Hey everyone, it's Miranda from Diamond Painting with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone's having a fabulous weekend. Um, if you're new, welcome to the channel. And if you've been back before, thanks for coming back. So I normally don't post on Sundays, but I didn't do a video for Saturday and specifically because I was waiting on this one. And this is going to be a bit of a treat for you guys because this is something you have never seen me or anything close to anything I have unboxed. But as you do know, um, I have a reason for everything. And so I hope you're sitting down. You thought when I got my Josephine Walls that was shocking. This is going to be shocking for you guys. So I'm really, really excited. So as you can tell, this is a Diamond Art Club box. Um, this was a pre-order, not for Black Friday or anything, but it was about a month ago. I've been kind of waiting on this. And yeah, let's get into it. So it is a round because you can see we do have a magenta line right here, but it also says round right here on the box and it's got a circle. So what do we have? We have St. Francis of Assisi's by, I'm going to bring it down because I can't see, I want, I want to, Stetsutsky, I'm probably not even saying that right at all, but yeah. I was really excited for this. I think it's super, super cute, and it reminds me of my dad. So I'm just going to leave this right here for a little bit and just tell you a little bit. Um, although I'm not practicing, I was raised a Catholic. And so uh, St. Francis of Assisi was born Giovanni di Pietro di Bernardone in Italy, and he was born approximately like um, 1100. 82 and passed away October 3rd, 1226. Um, and he was an Italian Catholic friar um, or a deacon, and he founded the Men's Order of Friars Minor, the Women's Order of St. Clair, and the Third Order of St. Francis in the Custody of the Holy Lamb. Um, let's see, and then Pope George the Ninth canonized Francis on July 16th, 1228. And he was designated a patron saint of Italy. He later became associated with the patronage of animals and the natural environment. So basically now um, St. Francis is known for uh, being like the patron saint, patron saint of animals and all things of nature and stuff like that. So if you guys haven't figured out, you know, I am Italian. I was raised Catholic. So back east, and I can't speak for everybody, but back east, um, you know, you can always tell an Italian because they always have a statue of St. Francis in their garden. Um, my dad has actually two, one in the front and one in the back. So when I saw this, I was like, oh my God, I have to, I have to get it. So now that I gave you that little backstory, um, we can start moving in and getting into this. So we do have a new, new toolkit, so I'm super excited about that. We have our sticker, which I'll show you, and we have our canvas and our drills. So here is a better picture right here. I think it's totally adorable. Um, the fact that there's other little critters, owls, birds. I think that's a cat. If I can, uh, if I see correctly. So I take my little sticker and I put it on the side of my box because I am in the process of reorganizing yet again my craft room. What else is new, right? So let's first look at, sorry, our toolkit right here. Now keep in mind, we still are transitioning. They still are transitioning. Um, I don't know why I did that. This is recyclable, so I'm going to get rid of that. It makes it easier. Probably not as pretty, but I'm not going to keep the bag anyway. So what do we have in our Diamond Art Club toolkit? So we do have a bag of baggies. I really like that they put them in a bag now. Ooh, we get this really pretty butterfly cover minder right here. I don't have this one. Um, it's got the two magnets right here. And if you're not sure what a cover minder is, it just holds back the plastic um, and is a little pretty decorative piece while you're painting. Got this really nice silver uh, washi, silver striped washi tape right here. We have a pot of two heart-shaped waxes, a, gr a green glitter pen, and a green squishy. We have a skinny 
four and seven placer right here. And they got rid of the white boat. And now we have a glitter, gold glitter boat with a little, oop, I put that in wrong, a little stopper right there. So I really like the new toolkits. I like the way they're going with that. Um, everybody loves to get little minders and washi, so I think that's super cool. I'm putting this in all janky. It's probably not even gonna fit. Yep, that's okay. Just stick this off to the side. All right, so now we have our little dust bag. I didn't even tell you guys what size this was. Oh my goodness. Anyway, I just told you it was a round. It is a 56 by 71 centimeter round. So 28 inches, 22 by 28 inches. So let's open up our dust bag. Now, Diamond Art Club's canvases are very, very soft. I do think that they've changed. They're not as soft as the material that they used to be. Um, but they still are very, very soft. So I am going to unroll this just to give it some time to flatten out. We have our drills right here. Ooh, look at that pretty blue, you guys. We do have our drills. So as you can see, it does... It is labeled right here. Nice little pack. We'll look at those later. Got our little step-by-step -step instructions. And it does have a coupon code on the inside. There's also a coupon code on your packing slip that comes in uh, your package, as well as the bottom of your canvas. And there's a QR code on the side of your box. So there are lots and lots of places um, that you can get a discount code. Diamond Art Club doesn't ever want you to pay full price. So here is our larger sticker. It does have our start and stop date. Um, a bigger sticker, so cute. And then the dimensions. And this has 37 colors with four ABs. Nice, this can be super sparkly. So right here. Now, remember, these are all peelable labels as well. So make sure you keep those. You can use them for any other kit. Um, and you can write on them and use those. So we've seen that. We'll put that over here. Lay this out. So hopefully, well, I'll probably have to move this back and forth because it is kind of long how I'm, how I am filming. But here we go. Oh my goodness. And that was an epic fail. But here we go. Oh my goodness, you guys. Look at this. So I'm rolling it as I go because we're just going to have to take a tour. So it says, do what makes you sparkle. Diamond Art Club right here. Oh my goodness. Um, we have our legend in the upper left and we have another one in the lower right. But let's slowly unroll this. Um, I'm going to hold it up just so you guys can see a little closer. No, that has a glare. So never mind. But we're going to slowly unroll this. So right here, we've got St. Francis, and he's got a little owl on his shoulder. Look at these really cute flowers over here. I'm like in love. There's like a nice little, there's a lot of color blocking confetti over here and over here, but this St. Francis himself is like straight color blocking. We have little colors in his cheeks. So now he's got some doves right here that he's holding, and then there's a little kitty cat down here in the corner. So way in the corner right here, you can see that there is a thumbnail and the dimensions, the name, uh, the artist, and Diamond Art Club right here. And then right over here is your other legend. So I'm just gonna peel the plastic back a little bit to see if it'll just lay a little flatter. Over time, like these lay really flat really quickly. Um, I didn't roll it back because I was too excited, but I probably should have. But if you just peel the plastic back and lay it down, um, it should uh, lay flat. So this is really like such a subtle, like not a crazy overdone image. I like the simplicity of it. Um, I like that it says St. Francis of the Feces. Now, you guys know that I am not, um, I'm very traditional as far as like my Italian upbringing, um, but I'm not very religious. I am more of like a spiritual 
be good to others type of person. However, this reminds me of my childhood. It reminds me of my dad. And we went to an Italian church growing up where the homily and all that stuff was in Italian. The prayers and the hymns were in Italian. So um, that's, that's why. I just really love it. And I'm so sorry that I can't get all of this. And at least you can see the top right there. I'll just move it up. What do you guys think? I just think it's so cute. And um, I'd like to do this in the spring. I don't really want to wait till October. Um, I know in New York, October is a 10 American month. So even though I'm in California, I still celebrate that in October. Um, but I would kind of like to do this in the spring. So hopefully I can. I told my dad I would get him one, but he said he doesn't have room in his house. So let's check out um, the drills and see where our ABs are. And then we'll flip this back over and see where the ABs go. What do you guys say? All right. So I'm going to flip this back over. Oh my goodness. I'm just like tossing stuff everywhere. I don't like to always, oh, you guys can't even see. Let me tilt you back down. I don't like taking these out. Because I can never get them back, but maybe because there's not that many. So we have, I'll show you these two because they are um, separated by themselves. So this, this um, these nice subtle, like gr warm greens and browns right here. Wow, I haven't seen 3865 in a Diamond Art Club. And if I have, it's been a very long time. All right. So I already see some in this first strip. Maybe they'll all be in the first strip. So we'll just go and see. Um, so Diamond Art Club does go by weight. So that's why they're not in numerical order. So. Um, here's our first one. These are twisted. Here's our first one. It is 104. It's like this really kind of sparkly peach color. There we go. And then we have 130 right next to it is this really nice yellow. So I don't think that this piece needs a ton of ABs personally. Um, let's see. These are also because it's just very simple. It's not supposed to be blingy. I, I think uh, there'd be too, it would be too much. So here is, this is an odd shaped bag, but here is a 141, which is white, and it'll be really pretty. I hope those are on the doves. And then here's our last one, this really pretty green 134. But since we'll finish up the strip, is that we have a couple stowaways in the mint right here, some green and some pink. You know what? Um, and then I'll just go through this to show you guys. We've got two of the th three eight six five blues. Like that. And then I'll just flip it over real quick because I don't want to mess it up. Ooh, look at that pretty color, this wine color right here. Wow, we've got four. Four bags of 3857. I have never seen that. I think this is going to be his robe. Just one little bag of 310. Yep, and that's it, you guys. All right, so let me clean this up and then we'll flip it back over, flip uh, St. Francis back over and we'll check out where the ABs go. All right, I'll be right back. All right, you guys. So that took me quite some time. And as you can see, it is looks nowhere near like it did when I first got it. So it is what it is. So let's flip St. Francis back over and check it out. All right, so we'll tilt up like that. I thank you, Diamond Art Club, for making one, one, two, two, three, three, and four, four. Um, it does make it a little easier. However, it's not a huge deal for me, but thinking about other people as well. So one is that peach color. So let us try and see 
where it is. And I'm going to be rolling this and moving it up and down just to make it easier. So there isn't very many ones, so it might be kind of hard for me. So I do see in here the twos are inside of the flowers right here and the threes are the leaves of the flowers so I think that's gonna be very very pretty so we have our twos and our threes right over here um I am not seeing where the ones are oh no is that it is that a T no that's it so the, the ones are in the owl's head right here And then the fours are all in the wording for St. Francis. So I think that's going to be really, really pretty. Um, there's also fours in his eyes. Um, not in the feet. But let's see with that pretty uh, three, 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 eight, five, seven. Yeah, that is his robe. So his robe is going to be this really pretty um, wine color. And that is it really for the AB. So it's going to be nice and subtle. I like that. Uh, the doves are 3865. Oh, there's also some ABs in the kitty cat's eyes right there as well. I think this is going to be so pretty. I'm definitely going to frame this. Um, I'm not quite sure where I'm going to put it yet. But... I'm so happy that I got this. I will link this kit below if you guys are interested in it. Um, yeah, I just, it just reminds me of my dad. It reminds me of home. It reminds me of growing up. So that's why I got it and I absolutely love it. I haven't seen anybody else unbox this one. Um, so let me know what you guys think. If you've made it all the way through, leave me an animal emoji at the bottom um and let me know what you guys think all right you guys other than that um let's recap real quick we have saint francis or francis assisi it's he is a 56 by 71 centimeter round with 37 colors with four ab's um yeah i really i was really happy when i saw this one so thank you diamond art club i really really Love this one. All right, you guys. Well, I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day and a great beginning of your week. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.